You are so tired. You're all knotty. Oh, I've had so much stress lately. I can imagine, babe. Look, I'm bloody stressed at the minute. Oh, yeah. I need a bloody massage. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> oh, babe, should we go to an elf spa or something? Babes, obviously, like, me getting this assistant now, and it's just stressing me out, Gem. The thing is, though, the only person that I've interviewed is Harry, and I'm proper nervous. But, babes, you've interviewed so many people, do you know what I mean? So you can help me do it, because I ain't got a bloody clue. Amy, I will give you all the help I can. When you interview someone, Amy, you need to be looking for, you know, that person to be professional, personable, someone that is going to be polite to your customers. Yeah. And remember, the customer is always right. That is the best saying someone ever made up. And also, when you're interviewing, you know, look at the person, look at their eye movements as well, Amy. You can tell a lot from yeah. someone's eye movements. If they look left, if they look right, if they look up, if they look down, you need to be weighing that person up. I don't want to scare them, though, Jim. I don't want to be like Simon Cow. I'm still only coming to Amy's salon. No, I know, I know. We're not going to scare them, but you just need to sort of gauge their reactions when you're speaking to them. You'll be picking up everything. You'll be picking up how they move. I'll be picking up how much makeup they got on and how much lip liner they got on. Hmm. How's that pressure, babes? Fabulous.